Hey what's up YouTube this is FTV here and he is back with tutorials so as I promised in my previous update I'm to in this video I'm going to be showing you how you can get this very very cool looking uh, dog kind of thing it's not actually a dog it's it just organizes my things in a good way so what you want to do the first thing is you want to download the link or the file in the description and it will be this file object doc plus and uh, it's going to contain these files doc, object doc plus setup and the readme and there's one little file there that I won't like to show in front of you guys you just download the file and you'll get to know what it is so there's a readme inside the document and uh, inside the file the folder and you can read that and uh, just customize your uh, object doc and it's going to look just like that so one thing I can tell you how to uh, add these tabs uh, now once you've done all that alright so let's start from the beginning once you've done all that's done, uh, that's written in the readme document, you'll get this doc right here. And uh, you won't have this locations, you have all these things. So what you want to do simply is right click on the doc, go to doc settings. And uh, alright, so this is object doc plus. And you go to themes, you can have or download themes. But I personally like this one, so I haven't done that. Then you go to hotspots and all that. And these are doclets, and these are just for customizing your doc and now comes positioning um, now you can make this dog come at the top like that at the bottom like I have or the left right I personally like the bottom alright so yeah uh, that's through the positioning the size and appearance these are all the sizes and all that and this is the most important thing tabs and styles and this this uh, uh, category actually allows you to uh, make your own tabs so let's see let's say I want to make a new tab here named YouTube so I'll just click on add tab click on add a new empty tab and I'll just type in YouTube in there and uh, yeah that's that whoa I start YouTube and let's say I want to make a shortcut of the recycle bin on that so I'll just click the recycle bin and I click and drag it to the YouTube uh, well tab and drop it out here and it's going to make a shortcut and now if I move my uh, mouse to the very uh, bottom of the screen right like that uh, this drawer is going to come up and if you click on this recycle bin it's going to open up the recycle bin it's uh, pretty much like a dock but I think it's pretty cool I think it's cooler than a dock is now one thing you see is that the YouTube is not completely visible so what you can do simply is click and drag the side and that's going to resize your dock just like that and if you want to add a separator so um, let's see I have this movie here and I'll click and uh, move it to the YouTube tab then I'll drag it here and I'll click it here alright so there you go. there it is and let's say I want to make a, a separator between the recycle bin and the movie so I just right click here go to add entry and it's new separator and click on, on the separator and move it here and uh, separate it now right so um, yeah that's that and uh, one more thing you can do is uh, actually there's pretty much things you need to do in the readme document and I wouldn't like to I wouldn't like to actually expose the readme document at the moment you can just download the file and uh, then you can see for yourself what that really is um, so yeah let's unpin everything here simple uh, to unpin click oh click and drag it out and yeah you can actually move the dock around wherever you want you can actually uh, position it right in between the screen or uh, right here and you wanna, if you want to remove the YouTube tab just go into tabs and styles select the YouTube tab and click on remove tab and uh, it's gonna ask you for confirmation hit yes and uh, yeah so, uh, so let's me, let me show you the tabs I have here I have the internet tabs, everything connected to the internet. Then you have my applications that doesn't really have much. Just the uh, m major applications from Windows that I use. Then I have the design for Fraps, Camtasia Studio Recorder, Photoshop, and After Effects. Then I got these games, uh, the games that I have. Then I have the media for listening to music and all that stuff. Then I have Office, Office 2007 shortcuts. So I can just click and uh, it opens it up. And then I have the locations that are actually well, all right. So let's close that up. 
and in the locations I have the my computer, my documents, my pictures, and my music. I think I could put my videos in there as well. So um, yeah, that's that. And when you're done editing and uh, you're satisfied with customizing it, just hit close, and everything's good. So yeah, that's that's all I wanted to show you. Please uh, download the file once and see what inside what's inside it. I actually cannot reveal what inside what's inside it, so you have to download and see for yourself. So yeah, 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 that's that. That's all I wanted to show you. Uh, hope you liked the video, guys. Please comment, like, and subscribe. And uh, thanks for watching.